All right, guys, just playing Call of Duty again. I know, I know. When you hear that intro, you think to yourself, it's another complaining video. Um, the thing is though, you gotta complain to these uh, developers. Otherwise they, these are, if you don't complain to these type of people, they will keep giving you shit in the bag and expecting money for it. Um, I'm telling you. And um, so what I had in mind, I was gonna watch a uh, older kill streak video that gameplay that I had gotten, and uh, we was gonna watch it back. And uh, this was on the online lobby. This was not against bots. Um, this was on Modern Warfare twenty. Uh, 19 and um, the skill based matchmaking I don't care what you say the skill based matchmaking was not as rigged as it is today and uh, to prove my point um, I get in a lobby today and uh, I maybe get a 5 or a 6 kill streak and then the next the next respawns I get shit on it's so hit or miss um, with the new skill base matchmaking system they have. It's so thick. It shouldn't be there. Um, we need more maps 6v6. We need a map vote. Um, too many damn skins, bro. Put more maps in the game, bro. Um, stop supporting uh, Battle Royale. Bro, Call of Duty ain't Battlefield. It's okay. It's okay to be a 6v6 or 10v10 or 12v12 on a mid-sized map. You don't have to be on this huge map acting like Battlefield. Which, by the way, y'all do a very bad job at long-range sniping combat. Like, if I want to play... If I want to play a game where I'm doing long-range sniping shit, I'll play Battlefield. I'm not going to play Call of Duty. So, um... But, if, if vice versa, if I want to play... The game that's close quarters combat and I'm the point man and I'm telling you go around here go around here I'll go up the middle you go up the middle whoever goes which way take him sink shot I will play Call of Duty or Far Cry so we're gonna go ahead and watch this video and then we're gonna watch a uh Now this is a streak that I got on Modern Warfare 2019. Check it out. 25 streak I got on here. It wasn't gun streak. So it, was, it wasn't a 25 gun streak, but it was a 25 um, including the kill streaks. Oh, yo, I got that PSVR too. That shit is fire, guys. That shit is nice. I don't care what you guys say. Um, the skill-based matchmaking used to be it, it didn't used it didn't used to be that's the point i'm making there was never any um rigged hit markers there was never any rigged skill based matchmaking and if it was if it always was there like they they keep constantly claiming it was turned down a notch watch the video count the kills guys All right, so I'm waiting for my team to spawn in.
All right, so my first death right there. It's one kill. Two kills. Three kills. All right, so here, this streak starts now. I'm pretty sure, guys. All right, there's a double kill. There's one, two. Three, four. By the way, the Predator missile used to be a four kill streak. And it used to count towards your kill chain. So that's five kills now. Six. Seven. I think I have some sentry gun kills as well. So it's 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 an eight kill streak with three sentry gun kills and a a pred kill, a predator missile kill. I think I'm waiting for the AC-130 right here, and he comes through. He finally comes through. Here he comes. So gunship, very very easy for me to get back in the day. Alright, so look at my uh, kill chain. My kill chain is right over here. This is all the kill chain. So I'm still going. 
There's another kill. There's another kill. I still haven't died in this one. And finally I went down. Okay, my point being, guys, I used to be able to I used to be able to run kill streaks, get them, and still cap objectives. My um my estimated time that I'd be alive per life before before being killed and respawned was probably like um I say two minutes on average. With an occasional I could go on a streak for that last like five, six minutes. And, um, you just, you can't do that anymore. I feel like, um, I stay alive for like 30 seconds in the new Call of Duties. It's skill-based matchmaking, okay? It's, um, rigged hit detection. The red dots are no longer on the mini-map. Like, the, the mini-map acts as your ears. Like, um, whose brilliant idea was it to take the red dots off the mini-map? The mini-map acts as your ears. And um, I can remember um, so many times there being a red dot so close to my position. And um, I didn't fire at him because I didn't want to alert enemies of my presence. And silencers used to mean stuff. If you had a silencer on your gun, you didn't appear on the minimap. Now nobody appears on the minimap. Um, there used to be red tags around the, the enemies' names. And blue tags, there used to be blue tags around friendlies and red tags around enemies. And, uh, you know, there's they took that out of the game. There's not enough maps in the game. There's no map vote. Um, kill streaks make the game fun for me. Now, other people enjoy the gunplay. I, I'm one of them, too. I enjoy the gunplay, too. Um, definitely love the good graphics and the audio. Which is, I guess, why people are so upset about the game. Because the game is so nice. And like I said, you have to put these people in check. Otherwise, these are the type of people who will keep making a shit in the bag game and trying to sell it to you for such a high price. You have to check these people. I, I hate being the guy sounding like I'm complaining. But, um... And skill-based matchmaking, I'll give you an example. If, if a new person come in and he's put in a lobby with all new people, he's not going to learn how to play the game. You got to get shit on a few times before you realize, oh, I can't just go out into the open. And like, um, and same for the higher rank people. If the higher rank people get into a lobby of all higher ranks, there's going to be no, there's going to be no action in that lobby. And it has to be that they know this and they're intentionally ruining it. It has to be that. It has to be. Because they wouldn't do that. It's They, they just want to make money, guys. They just want to make as much money possible. They have completely abandoned the formula that got them to money making in the first place. And um, that's all I can say. Um... So let me let me see how long I was on the map for. I was on the map for six minutes before I died on that streak. In uh, Modern Warfare 2, I, I can't even stay alive for two minutes. Like, um, forget an AC-130. My kill streaks are... Um, my kill streaks... Um, I'll tell you what my kill streaks used to be back in the day. My kill streak used to be a Predator missile... And, the, and that's another thing. They took the Predator missile from a um, four kill streak. It's now a six kill streak. And um, Predator missile no longer counts to your kill chain. But that used to be the, my streak package. Used to my kill chain package used to be 
Predator Missile, Sentry Gun, AC-130. Kill streaks made a game fun for me. I love the gunplay. I love getting kills with my gun. Don't get me wrong. But when I got that kill streak, I felt so good. I can't get a kill streak at all these days. I, I have my kill streaks on Predator Missile, UAV, and Harrier Jet. I call them high rolling kill streaks. Um, I can no longer high roll in this game. It's either the skill based matchmaking, the rigged uh, hit detection. It's it's just ridiculous, guys. Uh, I will end on a positive note. Um, Gran Turismo Seven, um, No Man's Sky on PSVR Two. Um, what's the other game I've been playing? I played Pavlov on PSVR Two. Um, and a couple other PSVR 2 games are really nice. Um, I'm somebody who has uh, like uh, all the gaming technologies. Like over here, I got my Valve Index over here. And over here, I got my PSVR. And over there, I got my PC. And over there, I got my um, PS5. And like... I, lo I just I just love how Activision like to act like they know what they're talking about and like people like me just don't know what they're talking about. And it it couldn't be more bogus. It couldn't be more bogus. The only reason they're saying that is cuz they want to keep making money. They don't want to to they don't want and I, I don't even want to put the game in a negative light. <laughs> it's just if you don't call these people out, they're then they're not going to do the work to make it right and um that's where we're at, and that, that's it's unfortunate because it's such a good game. I I honestly think Call of Duty's gonna fall off. Um, I think it's gonna fall off. I think games like uh, Ready or Not, Sandstorm, Insurgency, um, lots of games like that are gonna take it over. And last thing I will say, if I want a long range combat, I will go play Battlefield. Call of Duty needs to stop with all this Battle Royal. I hate Battle Royal. If you like it, good. That's good. You 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 play Battle Royal, but I don't like Battle Royal. Call of Duty form Call of Duty's formula to money making and success was not Battle Royal. It was a uh, close quarters combat. And um if I want Battle Royal, I'll go play Battlefield. If I want close quarters, I'll play Call of Duty. Call of Duty needs to remember which game it is. I feel like Call of Duty is trying to be Battlefield, and uh, it's not a good look. I'm out.